Welcome everyone, I'm Joey, and this is my garage. Welcome everybody to this week's episode of Joey's Garage. Today I'll be testing out aftermarket CDI computer units for GY6 engines. They range from black for stock, orange for performance, and blue for racing. Tests have shown that the orange performance and the blue racing do affect the advancement and timing of the engine, and they also may give very small gains in performance. But they also will give engine kickback, they'll give hard starting, and excess, excessive wear to the engine. So if you'd like a better explanation of exactly how timing and what kind of performance gains you should expect, check out the show notes below and I'll give a couple links to some videos. But what I'm going to be testing today is to see exactly what's inside of these. I'm going to cut some open to compare and see if the rumor is true that the racing CDIs are full of gravel and rock. I bought a couple off of eBay and Amazon to compare and see what's inside. I also bought one from nycscooters.com and this is the one that I recommend. This is an advancing CDI so it acts as a stock as the during idling and low RPMs but once you get into the higher RPMs it advances the timing so you get that racing performance. But we'll see what's inside and cut them open. Alright everybody so I got the black stock CDI cut open. I can say for 100% sure there's no stone or gravel inside. What I did find is some electrical components and some very tough rubber. It was so tough that I actually switched from using my pneumatic air cutter to using a miter saw. I found that one to be the best to actually cut these open. So next I'll try cutting open this orange CDI unit. This one is the one I got off of Amazon, brand new, and I'm actually thinking this will actually have a cavity in it. So if you can hear it, it already has a screw loose inside. So we'll see what we have inside. Alright everybody, with the orange CDI I had some better success of getting it out in one piece. With this one, you can actually see the actual components, a very small kind of um, electrical board and it has a couple of resistors on it. Now with this one, it did have kind of a hard plastic around the actual board, but it didn't have that actual um, kind of rubber that the stock one did. So this had a better result, but again, no rock, no gravel, because that's what we're testing for. So next on the list is going to be the actual blue CDI one. We'll cut this one open and see what we can find. Now with this blue CDI, I was able to get it out. It came clean out through the middle. And again, it's going to be that hard plastic encased. So it's not going to be rock or gravel, but it is a very hard plastic. So from here, I'll try smashing it open and see what's inside. So I got the first blue CDI open. As you can see, it, has, it does have a circuit board but no loot, rock or gravel. So next one I'm going to test is going to be this one that I got off of Amazon. That first one was from eBay. And this one is different and has some writing on the top of it. If you can see that, some type of Chinese writing. And this one also does not have the LED indicator. So we'll cut this one open and see if it's the same or different. Thank you. 
All right, for the second CDI that I cut open of the blue, I got some good results. I actually did find some gravel inside. I'll post some pictures, see if you can get a better view. But I did able to get the circuit board. It does have the same, but as I said, we do have gravel. It looks like they use gravel as a filler, so they don't have to use as much as that hard plastic that everybody else is using. So this, we got some good results on this one. For the next and third blue CDI, I have this one. And this is I got off of eBay, and it actually is the only one that came in packaging. All the other ones just came in a plastic bag. So I'm gonna cut this one open and see what we find. So I got the third blue CDI open. Just like the other two, the motherboard did come out and it was encased with this kind of white hardened plastic, but nothing compared to that second one that I had to pry and just take almost a half an hour to get open. So for the last one, is gonna be the one that's gonna hurt the most. This is the one from nycscooters.com and it's the advancing timing one. It's about $40 and I highly recommend this one. The other performance ones were advanced timing, so it starts out at very high timing and it just kind of slowly tapers down. But with this one, it starts out very low, just like a stock, but once you get into the high, high RPMs, it'll bump it up real quick and then you'll get that performance gains. So let's cut it open. I hope everybody enjoyed this video and look into what is exactly inside a CDI computer units for GY6 engines. I learned for the black stock ones, they're filled with a hard rubber type of material. The orange performance and blue racing are filled with a hard plastic resin type of material. And the rumor is true that some of them are filled with a quartz gravel type of material that appears to be just used to reduce manufacturing costs. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you want updates on further videos. And with that, I'll say, ride safe and keep two wheels on the road.